<laughs> I didn't, but I'm deciding if I should wipe or if I should put a pad because I've never done this before and blood is dripping. Blood is dripping. Even though I have it inside me. Hello, I got my period last night and thank god that I had a panty shield on so I wouldn't be able to stain myself because you know how it says for us girls we end up staining ourselves because of not having a panty shield on so I had a panty shield on and I'm noticing I only have one pad left so you know what that means it's time to go period shopping so this is what I'm about to do I'm about to head to the supermarket to get a few supplies for my menstrual cycle for the month I won't be needing much items so I'm about to write down all what I need from the supermarket so yes all what I'm doing now is writing down what I need from the supermarket like my stay free pads, my nighttime pads, my chocolate and also some Panadols because I have some really bad period cramps this morning so hopefully the Panadol will help with the period cramps so I'll write down my stay free pads I don't remember the name of the pad I normally use at night since I haven't been using it for quite some time. So by stay free pads, I'll write down wings. I put wings in a bracket. And for the nighttime pad, I'll just put nighttime because I don't remember the name. <laughs> And some Advil, Panadol. And I'll write down some chocolates, like maybe some sweet chocolate snacks. <laughs> this is all what I need. I am going to head there now and I will show you guys when I'm at the supermarket. Last night I was feeling so down like when I got my period last night, it was only like a spot. Then after the spot, like I started seeing blood, and from there it took like only about less than an hour before I started feeling the strong period cramps. Then I went to bed so early last night, I fell asleep on the couch, and my boyfriend carried me to bed and. He started rubbing my belly for me, my tummy, and it felt so good, like it helped me fall asleep. So what do you guys do when you have bad period cramps? Do you guys take a heat bag to put on your belly? Do you guys take Panadols? What do you guys do? Because what, what he did last night really worked for me. It helped a lot with the period pain. So yeah. Approaching the store now. I am getting ready to enter, so I'll show you guys when I'm entering the store. one that has wings and I'm only seeing this one and it has 16 in it and the bigger size has 24 but it don't really it doesn't come with the wings and I'm looking for the ones with the wings so I guess I'll have to take both ones with the wings and one without the wings 
and I also need my nighttime pads. Oh, where is it? This is what I need for the nighttime, but I'm looking for a smaller version of it and I'm not seeing it because I love like I love taking the ones for the night because I love having two different brand pads, one for the day and one for the night. Since I'm not getting the smaller version of the nighttime pad, I will have to try something new. So I found one with wings, so it has 14 in it, so I'll have to go with this one and I'll have to go with my Stay Free. So, oh it's the same brand, Stay Free. <laughs> so yes, and what again do I need? I have my list in my pocket, but since my hand is full, I have to think of what I wrote down on the list. So I need my Advil and also I need some chocolates. So let's go and get the chocolates and the Advil. First time I'll be trying tampons and I'm so nervous because I've never tried tampons before so I'm super excited to see how I will feel trying it for the first time so I'll go ahead and take the tampons and when I get home I'll let you know how it feels I'll just show you the full process of me getting it while trying it <laughs> yes Panadol and I don't have any water with me so I'm going to head back in to get me a bottle of water <laughs> I'm about to put it in and I'll let you know how it feels for my first time. 
So I'll go ahead and open this up. So this is how it looks. Oh, I got a green one. <laughs> the packet is pink, but the tampon is green. So I'm about to try it and I'll let you know how it feels. I don't know. <laughs> I did it, but... <laughs> I'm deciding if I should wipe or if I should put the pad because I've never done this before and blood is dripping even though I have it inside me so I'll go ahead and put the pad just in case I end up staining myself <laughs> So I'll go ahead and use the stay-free pads. Like I said, I'm not too sure if I'm supposed to wear a pad, but um, just to be safe, I'll go ahead and use one because I've never done this before and I'm sweating. I'm to show you how nervous I am. <laughs> I only have one hand since this one has blood on it. I need to bathe. Um, I need to say take my second shower for today so I am going to go ahead and keep the fancy on and uh, I'll go ahead and take a shower and when I'm done I will put the pad on <laughs> so I'm just going to go ahead and put this in well wrap this and also wipe my hand so I'm going to go ahead and take a shower and when I'm done I will show you guys me putting on the pad <laughs> So yes, this is where I take a quick shower. I won't be showing you anything. <laughs> so I'm done taking a shower. I'm about to put my Stay Free Ultra Thin. And this is the overnight wings. This is the overnight pad. So I'm about to put it on because I already put on the tampon and the oil is kind of dripping down. I'm not too sure if it's supposed to do that, but just to be safe, I'll go ahead and put on my nighttime pad. So I'll go ahead and open it up. I like the color. <laughs> I was hoping to feel a bit strange when the tampon is inside me, but it feels normal. But apart from that, I notice a bit of blood dripping down. I'm not too sure if this is supposed to happen, but I guess I have to put on a pad, but it feels totally normal. So yes. The reason I had blood dripping down is because I put in my tampon wrong. I had the applicator and also the tampon was still in the applicator. This is why I had blood dripping down even though I had the tampon inside me the tampon was still in the applicator and the only part that came out was the bottom part where you're using to push it in your vagina that's the only part that came out but it was still <laughs> the tampon was still in the applicator and this is what happened because it's my first time putting on a tampon. This is the end of this video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give it a like and a comment. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye!